This is a My Deal Stash unboxing of the G1W Dash Cam. I purchased it from an eBay seller, and the model number listed on their site was the G1W slash DM8000. I purchased this once again from eBay from a distributor in China, so it did take a while to get. It took a couple weeks to get delivered to me. The first item I'm pulling out of the package is the G1W dash cam itself. The one thing you will notice is this silver head on the front of the camera. The only downside of that is it's it's a total standout when it's in your car. So if you're planning on keeping this in your car at all times, which a lot of people do, you might want to like paint that black or think about getting the black model. There you'll see that um, you have a slot for the micro SD card. Make sure you purchase a micro SD card. This didn't come with a card, so I had to purchase a micro SD card separately. I accidentally purchased the SD card because I thought that slot was bigger from the picture that I saw and I didn't see that said micro SD right next to it. So make sure it's micro SD. This right here is the in-car holder. It's a suction cup mount. From what I read online, it's one of the weaker links um, of the parts in this package. Um, some people report it falling off, but that may be due to incorrect installation. I was able to install the dash cam with that mount and it seemed to work fine. The only thing I, the only problem I ran into was that um, the device did fall off when it was just sitting in the car out in the sun. Um, this here is the 12 volt adapter to, um, I believe, 5 volt adapter for the dash cam. So one end is the mini USB, which hooks into the dash cam. Other end is for plugging into your car. And you use that to either charge the device and or just run the device while in your car. Um, this is the HDMI cable here. I wish they gave, gave us a little bit longer HDMI cable, but it's nice that they included. HDMI cables were pretty expensive a couple years ago. Um, this right here is the mini USB to USB. You use this to plug in your dash cam directly to your computer in order to copy your files off your dash cam or to charge your device directly from your computer. This here is the manual. It comes in Chinese, English, and Russian. These cameras are pretty popular in Russia. If you try going to YouTube and type Russian dash cam or Russian traffic accidents or Russian car dash cam, you'll get a lot of hits. Uh, they use it for insurance purposes over there. This is like a little warning guy. They call it warm tips. I think this may have been written by someone who speaks English as a second language. So I think they're just giving you some pointers about like what kind of memory cards to use and such. I used a SanDisk 8 gigabyte micro SDHC Ultra Class 10 card and it works pretty well so far. I've used it for about five hours now. I bought it from Best Buy for $12.99. Anyhow, thanks for watching this My Deal Stash unboxing of the G1W dash cam. Um, please watch uh, my other two videos about the actual demonstration of the device. I show how to use some of the special features um, before I go on the actual car ride demo. And then the third video is actual demo footage of the dash cam outside in the real world. All right, thanks again for watching, and we hope to see you at some more My Deal Stash videos sometime soon. My Deal Stash.